Before start this video, please subscribe my channel and click on bell icon. Thanks. May 12, 2023 at 3.26 p.m. Eastern Time there's a new Hyundai Kona for the 2024 model year, and while we've seen it in official press photos, the small crossover hasn't made it to dealerships yet. However, a pre-production Kona Electric was recently spotted rolling down a Southern California highway and Kindelato on YouTube was there to catch it on video. This is the first time we've seen the restyled Kona in public. It debuted globally at the end of 2022 with a U.S. appearance in April at the New York Auto Show, and though we can't confirm it, the Kona seen here sure looks like the electric model used for Hyundai's official press photos. This gives us a chance to see the Kona beyond the confines of a structured photo shoot, and there's certainly no way to miss the yellow exterior. We also gain a better perspective of the Kona's proportions and styling cues, notably the controversial rear clip with its gate-spanning reflector up high and chunky taillights down low. This version also features body-colored trim over the wheel arches, lending to a broader appearance in profile. Motor 1. Com readers were critical of Hyundai's design direction in the comments of our Kona North America debut post. Will this real-world video change those opinions? As a refresher, Hyundai revealed three trim levels for the 2024 Kona in New York. This is obviously the EV packing a standard-issue 48.6 kilowatt-hour battery pack that provides an estimated range of 197 miles between charge stops. A 64.8 kilowatt-hour battery pack is optional, extending the range to an estimated 260 miles. Regardless of the pack, the Kona Electric is capable of 400V fast charging that can replenish the battery from 10 to 80% in 43 minutes. Front-wheel drive is the only powertrain option. The other two Kona trim levels are the Limited and the Sporty N-Line. The former features the familiar 2. 0-liter 4-cylinder good for 147 horsepower or an optional 195 horsepower 1. 6-liter turbo, whereas the N-Line gets the turbocharged 1. 6-liter 4-pot standard. The turbo engine also adds an 8-speed automatic transmission versus a CVT, and all-wheel drive is optional. Pricing still hasn't been announced but it should be coming soon as combustion-powered Konas will reach dealerships in the summer. The Kona Electric won't arrive until the fall. Source, Kindle Auto via YouTube. Thanks for watching my video. Please subscribe my channel for more auto updates.